after this, don't worry. We might end up with a hillbilly uh, Drift King. Because I know people like Drift King. No scribbling intensifies. <laughs> Shout out to us. Oh, hot damn. One of the um, one of the very s stronger maps as well for a, a survivor. This map can have between like 20 to 25 pellets. A lot. <laughs> a lot. You'll see like every corner here, pellet. Pellet over there. Pellet over there. The jungle gym pellet there. Uh, you get the point. There's a lot of pellets on this map. So in this map, don't get greedy. Especially when you're versing clown. The clown's biggest... Uh, Strength is a uh, so taking advantage of survivors that become very greedy with the pellets. Um, it, you have to change your style of gameplay. If you see a pellet, just put it down straight away. Beautiful. I can start building up my stacks as well immediately. Wait a minute. Where did that Claudette go? Oh, she went this way. <laughs> that was odd. I may as well just switch targets. That's, is that Makari? He, he will know. He knows that there's a lot of pellets on this map, so he can stall me for quite a bit. Hide my light here. Good stuff. Second to last match, then. Yes. It's like good enough. I might be able to get a throw here. Nice. That means that. Now nah, he will still make that. He can make an extra loop here. Good stuff. See how he made the extra loop? It's exactly what you want to do. Nice. He, he didn't want to get hit by the gas cloud, so he continued running. However, it wasn't going to work either way. So, pretty much he was screwed either way. I'll just keep refilling, dude. I see Claudia. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to switch targets. I'm going to hide my light. pre lunch here. Nice. She's, uh... Could be urban. I'm not sure. I'm not going to throw a gas cloud just here. I just, I don't want to waste it. Nice. If she was going to opt for that window, I'll throw another one. That was, a, that was a little bit too short. There we go. And she shouldn't make this unless she's got dead hard. No dead hard. Awesome. Hey, Vin. I, 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 I like that. <laughs> it's awesome. But terrible if you run um, balance landing. Uh, Dynamite, the funny thing is the only places you can use balance landing on this map is... Uh, the stairs and the tree in the middle, uh, but you have to angle yourself on top of that tree. Nice, she's not my obsession, so I can, um... See how I blocked her path? She didn't know what to do, she panicked. So, uh, you can safely say that she she got greedy. Okay. Oh, baby. Clown, yo. Clown. Now, I really need to start kicking gens as well. I've got Pop Goes the Weasel. However, I've already built up six stacks too along the way. So it's not looking too bad. You can see the trick. Wait, what are you talking about, sir? You can see the trick. Uh, so what I'm talking about is... I'll show you now, my friend. I probably shouldn't be wasting time going there, but I'll show you anyways. That tree in the middle, that big, big, big one. The the world tree in World of Warcraft, or whatever. Tell, tell just so. If you go up right over here... Climb on top of it and jump. You actually stagger and you get a balanced landing out of it. Now, it does require you to go to that one specific spot though. So, if you don't have time or you can't reach it, then you did. All right, someone's gone for the save. All right. Wasted a little bit of time. She's my obsession. I don't want to go for her. I really don't. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go back for the other guy. I'm sorry, man. I know you're going to hate me. You're going to hate my guts for doing this. Let's just block all the path. That was dead hard, in case you're wondering. Pop goes the weasel part? Nah, not that good. Overcharge itself... Overcharge will only be good against new players that don't know how skill checks work or have never done a skill check in their lives. However, most rank ones will hit uh, over uh, overcharge. Um, it's not that great. And the, f the bad thing about overcharge is you actually can tell when a generator has overcharge on it from the sparks. From the certain amount of sparks on it. Let's ignore it for a second. Uh, is there any generator I can kick? No. There we go. That one in the middle. I have to kick it immediately. Come on, come on, come on. Pop goes the weasel. When you see the red sparks, that means pop goes the weasel. Beautiful. 25% straight off the bat. Just gone. Ganskis. Alright, I wonder who's going for this save. 
Please don't be the Meg. Is it the Meg again? No, it's a Claudette. Sw now, now I can switch targets. What are Q times in Australia? It can be quite bad sometimes. Someone's on my totem, I heard that. You know what the best thing about this is? I grabbed my obsession, which means I didn't lose any stacks. I actually maintained it all. Overcharge on Freddy OP? Yeah, overpowered. That's unfortunate. Uh, that was a little short. I gotta be a little bit more patient on these. Uh, you wanna throw a little bit lower as well? It's not like the Huntress where you have to throw a bit higher. This is actually the opposite. Because he throws in like a bit of an arc. Pop goes the weasel this, by the way. 25% again. Remember how this generator was close to being completed? Look at that, it's almost back to zero. This is why Pop Goes Weasel is a phenomenal, phenomenal perk. If you if you get going and you start downing people left, right, center... Ah, uh, yes, remember how we hit our light wall, we just looked elsewhere? She got confused. You grab the obsession, yeah. Grabbing the obsession is probably the best thing in the game. Now, if I really want to be a scumbag this game, what I can do is... It's too late for it. But what I could have done is... Get my eight stacks, have her on the hook still, and then face camp her legit until she dies, or secure secure the kill before they unhook her. That way, once the obsession dies, I can't lose stacks anymore. Which is good. Very, very good. Uh, they got my totem now. That's okay, guys. Only one gen being done this like late into the game now is quite solid. It means I'm doing very good. That gen uh, all the way back at zero again. Let's go to this middle one, because that was close to being completed. That's my obsession, you bastard. I don't want you. Alright, sweet, Makati. Perfect. That was a direct headshot. I'm gonna throw another one. This way he's forced to use the, the pellet. We got a little bit greedy there. Should have just placed it straight away, man. Remember how we were talking about greed before? The only reason why you get hit by a clan is mostly due to greed, or you're pretty much just screwed either way. I'm gonna go the same way, though. Nice, that was dead hard. Beautiful played. So what I did there was, I made it look like I was going to the other side, but I switched sides and I still went to, I committed to the same side. And he walked into me. But the only reason why he got away there was dead hard. So it's okay. I should have just been a little bit more patient there. Funny enough, I actually walked with it too. He's going to go through the window, isn't he? Hide your lights, guys. Hide your kids, hide your lights, hide your wives. Do that, and you get free hits like that. Does it stay in effect though? Yes, it does. When the obs all save the best la uh, for the save the best for last does is when the obsession dies, it means that you can no longer gain stacks or you no longer uh, lose that. So if you had two stacks and your obsession dies, you'll be stuck with two stacks for the rem remainder of that game. That's all it means. It's not super duper duper that hard. Let's go back over here. Let's pop goes the weasel is. Yep, it's been worked on quite a bit. That's like 99. If I was the guy, I would have I would have completed that, but 25%. Hey, Fudgy Piggy, thank you very much for the follow electric piece as well. Welcome guys. Welcome. She might be back over there, I've got to be careful. See if the sparks are there. The sparks have disappeared, so that means that someone gen tapped this. So she's hiding. Uh she's hiding somewhere here. I see the scratch marks. I did see it, maybe behind these rocks. I don't want to kick it just yet as well. I want to wait a little bit. It looks like I'm going to have to. Because I don't know where she is. Well played. She just disappeared. It could have been the Claudette as well. If it was Claudette, that's a, there's a reason why I couldn't see her. Seems like a lot of points. Nice. Hey, Steve. Thank you for the follow. Steve Rick. No one's dead yet. I need someone to die. Don't forget, that generator that generator earlier was very close to being completed, so the Claudette would probably finish it off soon. Nice, there was no pallet here. Dead hard. Almost had me there, nice. And Dark Sandman, thank you for the follow. The follow train hype. The Michael Myers, just a tip. Do you use whispers? I'm terrible with knowing when someone's super close to me. I don't use whispers very, very often. Most, um, the only time whispers would ever be sort of useful to you is usually in the 1v1. Unless you're running specific builds builds that revolve around you finding someone within 32 meters, because for most killers, 32 meters is actually your terror radius. Um, except for like the Hag, Michael Myers. Um, is there anyone else I'm missing? Fred, I think Freddy? Even? I'm not sure. But yeah. 
Why didn't I kick this gen? Up goes the weasel. Oh. Yeah, I just got it in time. Oh my god. I actually screwed that up, guys. I almost did a very bad play there. She's over there hiding. That ostrich. Thank you guys for so much generosity time. Welcome, people. The funny thing is, I don't usually stream today. Uh, I don't stream Mondays. I stream. Uh, I take Mondays off usually, but because I stream Saturday. Sorry, I didn't stream Saturday. I took. Uh, I wanted to stream today to compensate for it. So appreciate you, everyone. Mm. Nice. We got one kill. Two gens left. So the next person I pretty much hook is gonna be on Death Hook. Or yeah, Death Hook. Uh, okay. Let's, let's give this a kick. Pop goes the weasel, you know? It's doing work this game. The amount of percentage I've already regressed just from this perk alone is too damn high. He's gonna get the win though. I wanna hit him again. So, let me just quickly go back this way. Nice. Remember, he's got dead hard, so. Nice job. I'm gonna break this. It's gonna be uh, very problematic later on. I can still see that generator has got its sparks. Pay attention to the uh, generators. If the sparks are still there, it means it's still regressing. It means no one has tapped that gen or no one's there. Just pay attention to it. Now, if Makati is plays this very right, he can stall me for the remainder of these gens. Mm. He's got a window over there. He can dead out this. Yep, he used. Have you realized he used his dead out to get closer to that? Damn, I'm, 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 I'm scared right now because that gen got completed and that gen was actually fairly close too. I've only got one more bottle left. I'm gonna block his entry to that shack. Sweet, we limited his options there. On my light. No, it didn't work. Can I get this? Very unlucky. I got no more bottles left too. Hmm. Come on, man. He's got God Palette. He's got so much to work with. So much to work with. You know what, guys? I might actually swallow my pride right now and actually leave this chase because I need to stop the generators. Remember how I was talking about Shelter Woods has the, one of the most the most pellets in the game? He's starting to go to all the pellets now and he's taking advantage of that. So what I gotta do is switch targets, go to the generator and find someone else. Just like that. I've got eight stacks. So I could utilize this. The other Meg is over there too. She's gonna complete that. Still another pallet here too. It's very lucky. Oh, what do I do, David? Do I go back there? I probably should. Makati's there too. Adrenaline. I had a feeling it was gonna be adrenaline. I knew it. I did see it coming. Alright. Yeah, there's not much I can do, guys. Shelter Woods. Dead hard. We'll get rid of him out of the game immediately. So we secure two kills this time. And I might be able to get a lucky third. Might be able to get a third. That generator, that gate's not worked on. Mm, let's see. Might even just have two. That game. She's over there. The other Meg decided to heal instead. And the best part about it is I know where she is. I'm going to hide my light here. Nice, I knew exactly where she was though. I might have to do a slug here. Nice, blocked her off. She's got a window. Alright, I want to secure this last kill. I really, really do. Because uh, I think I feel like I played very, very well this game. So I'm not going to just let the, the fact that this map just had so many pellets take that away from me. Does she have the gate? That is the real question. I saw fresh track marks, so she might not have been able to finish it. She didn't even start it. That's awesome. The real question is, where is she? <laughs> oh, ah, damn. Ah, there we go. She's hiding behind you. I'm going to pretend like I didn't see her, and boom. <laughs> Just like that. That was because of Save the Best for Last, why I recovered so quickly. And still effect. Apparently it is. I heard it. I never tried it. 
Uh, lucky, I thought it was something broken, but it turns out it's only 2% extra. Which is, I mean, it's still an exploit regardless, but um, lucky it's not full game breaking. Really fast, yeah. Yeah, he does. That's because of the uh, 8 stacks piggies. That's 40% extra recovery. Lucky. Now, now the real question is, where is she? Where is she? Dude, I'm probably not going to find her. And she probably even got hatched too, if she's lucky. So I'm not a huge, huge fan of slugging, only because I can't find the guys, like... Hmm. Would she have gone central? My luck, she's gonna get the hatch, watch. Someone was saying from 115 to 117, unless they're talking about something else. Uh, I don't know, man. That's very weird. Okay, we got the hatch. She can't, unless she already knew where it was. But that's so annoying. I don't know where to go. Where do you think? Where do you guys think she went? Corner over here, maybe. No, no her chance. It looks like it's gonna be a bleed out. Just in case, I'll check basement. I don't think she did, but. Yeah, no, no chance. What's the best way to play Michael if you use these three starting perks if they neg negatively impact? I would not use these perks unless you're going for the adept achievement. You better hope you play during rank reset or something, but you're gonna just have to do your traditional uh, try to get someone early, a little bit of light tunnel, and yeah, that's pretty much it. You can use add ons though, which is very nice. Did I just see her over here? No, I didn't. Um, you can use these add-ons to help you out for the adept achievement. So feel free to go like infinite tier three if you want. I really. It's up. Oh my gosh, she almost had it. She almost had it. <laughs> you ain't getting shit, boy. You ain't getting shit. That was close. Save the best for last one. Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, it's especially good on the clown. Uh, because, so you, re oops, so, example, you slash, you recover quickly, and you can throw another bottle straight away, and you're slowing someone down, so you actually close the chase faster than all the other killers, unless it's like a nurse or Billy, that's, that's a different story though, but yeah, very, very powerful, um, really awesome, and don't forget guys, that's without like, no extra add-ons too, it's, that's, Clown is a pretty solid character, he's not overpowered, he's not underpowered, he's solid, solid. You know what else is solid? The Chainsaw of Hillbilly, which